Hello everyone and welcome to my channel. If you're new to my channel, it's your first time watching. My name is Anna Cole. If you're a returning subscriber, welcome back. So today we are just going to do a bare-faced unboxing of regular Ipsy. Um, I decided just to grab one this month to see what I get. And I know this is super late, but better late than never, right? All right. I have stuff that's not inside my bag. I left my phone over there. Let me see if there's a card in here. All right, so there is a card that tells me what I'm getting. All right. One, two, three, four, five, six, okay. Um, I did grab one add-on. Dropped my card already. All right, so here is the bag, which I'm sure you guys have seen already. Um, I don't know where my plus bag went, but this is like a wool material. I don't know, I'm not a fan of this kind of like Sherpa, whatever it is material, but whatevs. Um, color's cute. I definitely like the plus bag better. Um, okay, so. Let's start with the first thing on the list, and that is right here. So this is the Benefit Cosmetics Roller Lash. There we go. It is Benefit Cosmetics Roller Lash Curling Mascara in Black. It says, looking for your next Holy Grail mascara. This water-resistant formula is pure magic. The unique hook and roll brush does does it all. It grabs every last lash to separate lift and curl plus the instant curve setting formula, conditions your lashes and stays put for 12 hours. And there's a tip that says gently wiggle the wand from the base of your lashes to the tip and repeat with another coat. This is a deluxe sample. The full version retails for $25. I have not tried this mascara before. I don't think I've ever even received it. So that's what the wand looks like. It looks pretty good to me, honestly. So I will definitely try this. I definitely like when the wands have like the smaller bristles. I think it's easier to work with. Um, the next item on my list is from It Cosmetics. Is this product here. And this is the It Cosmetics Confidence and Cream. It says, once you keep your glow going through winter, this quick absorbing super cream is clinically tested to give skin a healthier, more radiant appearance. It's all thanks to a combo of skin quenching vitamin E, hydraulic hyaluronic acid, colloidal oatmeal, shea butter, ceramides, and more. And the tip for this is to smooth this moisturizer onto clean skin and neck using upward sweeping motions. The... Full size retails for $49 and this is a deluxe sample. Um, the next item on my list is from Beauty For Real. It is a tinted lip balm. If I could hold it in my hand properly. So this is it here. It's a tinted lip balm. This is in the shade Hannah. Which looks like it's like a... I don't even know what to call that. It looks like brown. Um, <clears throat> it says you get the best of many worlds with this tinted lip balm. It's got that rosy brown tint, delivers all day hydration, and is created in collaboration with Brooke USA, whose mission is to improve the lives of working horses, donkeys, and mules all over the world. That's cool. So this is the full size, and it retails for $14. And I'm just going to put some on. Okay, so it does have a little bit of a tint. It's not like overwhelming. It feels nice on the lips. So I'll definitely use that. Let me stick that over here. All right, the next item on my list is here. It is this here. It's the Mark Anthony 
True Professional Strictly Curls Curl Defining Lotion. Consider this multitasking lotion a one ticket, a one way ticket to the best curls of your life. It's infused with vitamin E and silk proteins to give curls major control and definition, but without any stickiness or crunch. It even repels humidity to keep frizz and flyaways in check. This is a deluxe sample. The full version of the product is 8.3 ounces and it retails for $7.99. So this is only 1.69 fluid ounce. So this will probably last me maybe two times. My hair is so long and so thick. I actually do need something. My hair looks a little bit mm, not good today because I had to use my daughter's hair products so I actually ran out. And I just ordered stuff from Ulta, but they did not have, um, oh my gosh, what do I use? It's the coconut and hibiscus leave-in conditioner, I think. I don't know, I took it in the living room. I don't remember what it is, but either way, they didn't have it. I don't know, this it smells okay. It doesn't smell like what I'm used to, but... I will definitely try it. Like I said, I definitely need something and I probably won't be able to buy anything until like the middle of January. So we're good with that. Um, so the last item is this here. So this is from Sugar Cosmetics. It is matte as hell lip crayon. It's in the shade Stephanie Plum. Is that what, is that correct? Yep, 15 Stephanie Plum. Um, it says a pair of oversized sunglasses, oversized sunglasses plus a swipe of this berry lip crayon equals your new two second beauty look. It coats lips and it coats lips is in. I think I was supposed to say in. It coats lips in an intense plum color that stays fresh from your morning coffee to evening cocktails and the matte texture it'll never crack flake or dry out on your lips promise um this is a deluxe sample and the full size retails for twenty dollars and ninety nine cents let's see if i can get it open Okay, that came off way more than I wanted it to. The whole like tip came off on my hand. It feels real creamy on my hand though. And that is the shade. So it's definitely something that I will try. All right, so then the last item that I got is from Illamasqua. And I got the sample of their foundation. So their skin-based foundation. Um, I grabbed it in the shade, I don't know. I don't remember what shade this is. Um, let's see if it looks okay on my hand. If I can get it open. Okay, so it smells like makeup. You really gotta squeeze to get some product out there. It looks light, but I will try it at some point anyway. Yeah, okay. So I was a little a little concerned because I got a, um, I think it was either a moisturizer or a primer from them, and it was heavily scented. Um, so this does say it has um, fragrance in it, but it's the last ingredient. So um, it's not heavily perfumed. I will try it. Um, I'm really iffy when it comes to products that have a lot of fragrance in because it tends to irritate the skin. I have sensitive skin, so I definitely don't want to, you know, irritate my skin, especially with like a primer or moisturizer. Like one of the first layers on, on the skin, I definitely don't want that to be heavily fragranced. But anyways, that was my glam bag for the month of December. Um, I will probably go ahead and grab just a regular glam bag next month. 
skip my plus just for financial reasons. I think $12 is more acceptable than $25. As much as I love the Glam Bag Plus, I will pick it back up in February with the Glam Bag X. Um, so yeah, so you'll see another regular Glam Bag next month and then we'll get back into the bigger stuff in February. So that's all I have. If you do like this video, please be sure to give me that thumbs up. Hit that subscribe button to stay up with new videos. I will see you guys in the next one and I hope you have a good rest of the day. Bye now.